Artie Lang here reporting live June 10th, 2024 from the gorgeous, beautiful, stunning $6.69 Vincenzo Gold Crypto Investing Studio overlooking gorgeous Lake Superior. Have you been fleece hesitated and s heisted by the market manipulation and criminal gangsters that implemented and execute a flawless plan to beat down and steal retail investor money? Old Vincenzo is here to give you the truth and education that you need and deserve. I am not a financial advisor. I don't promise get rich quick schemes or tell you to buy or sell anything. I just educate you on the once in a hundred years silver bull market that is still just in its infancy that I believe will generate generational wealth and life changing money. A simple bell notification, a free subscription down below. Super chats to support channel become members such of Jabroni Kellers. Yes, only two. 99 a month best value on YouTube. Vincenzo's Gold Crypto Investing Bell Notification. Like the channel and most importantly, subscribe for free down below with one simple, super easy click. Good 10th day of June, if we can believe this already, steadily marching our way towards the mid part of the first month of meteorological summer, if we can believe this already, with our rocky Bitcoin and cryptocurrency market, the ups, the downs, and the sloshes in between with this overcast, gorgeous, beautiful, ha, cumulus nimbus clouds streaming in from the west and southwest out of, out of a seasonably uh, mild warm front with a current temperature of 73 degrees, J out there at the Central Illinois Airport in Bloomington. And I ask you to bell notification, comment down below, like and share the fleece heist and shist, the heisters, shysters, and fleecers out there that are here to knock down and manipulate you out of your money, your hard-earned fucking money, whether it be on CNBC, Fox News, the Clinton News Network, CNN, or any of the other mainstream media sources that have the promoters, that have the paid charlatans and fleecers out there uh, to fear monger you and to FOMO you in to lose all your hard earned fucking money. And then we have this guy, I think uh, maybe affiliated with XRP Sniper. Uh, he just likes to comment nonsense and, and, and whatever. And you can see here, I'm thinking the jabroni killer might have done a rug pull on you. How have I rug pulled anybody XRP Purple? And I believe this is XRP Sniper or XRP uh AXIG or AXRP, any of these other shyster coins that you, my good man, have brought to this channel and that I've told you repeatedly, AGIX uh, and a few of these other shyster coins that we're going to go down 99.9% .9 to 100% and you continue to buy. Uh, you definitely put on a good story, but I have yet to see any of your predictions to make money come true to fruition. I have never promoted anything to get rich quick scheme. I have promoted that I believe 99.9% .9 of all crypto coins will go uh, to zero. And I've promoted that since 2021 when I came out on here to Vincenzo's Gold Crypto Investing. And I've repeatedly said, I believe the crypto coins are nonsense. Most of them, 99.99% will go to zero. And I was an advocate of selling in 21 and that most of these coins that you guys brought on here were garbage. And you seem to be XRP sniper. And you seem to be just the guy that likes to... Uh, say a bunch of nonsense, right? Uh, and promote a bunch of garbage and talk a bunch of trash because you yourself have made bad life choices, bad financial decisions, bad investments, and maybe taking on bad job opportunities. And you have cost yourself, nobody else, because I am not a financial advisor, nor do I encourage or promote you to buy or sell anything, nor do I put down in the pinned comments promote you to go to any website to buy or sell anything. The only websites that I put on there are my social media websites and uh, Robinhood because people have asked where I buy gold and silver. So I put Robinhood because that's one of the sites that I buy. But you can see my response. You gold and silver stocks I'm holding that I've been accumulating for six years are still up 25 to 75% after the recent big correction. I'm also the one that Kept saying crypto bear market in 2021 and all crypto coins crashed 59 to 95%. Some gone completely like the FTXs, like the BlockFi's, like the three arrows capitals, uh, like the uh, Celsius's of the world, the big connects, right? Uh, and amongst the rest of these shyster coins, I've never set to buy anything, especially crypto. As I've stated, I believe 99.9% .9 of coins are worthless. 
And uh, you, you just seem like a shyster, a scumbag, a fleecer, and a heister that has made horrible life decisions, uh, not doing your own research on investments that you buy, uh, and things have not worked out for you because I know you are XRP sniper. I can feel it. I can smell it. I can sniff out XRP sniper from three years ago. And that is the same thing you used to do. And I believe you are the same guy in other accounts that used to say XRP would never get below a dollar when I was promoting it. Then it would go below a dollar. And then it would sneak back above a dollar. And you would say it would never go back below a dollar. And then it would go back below a dollar. Then it would go blah, 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 and so on and so forth. But you have to make your own educated decisions. I'm only showing you things that I am purchasing, things that I accumulate uh, in my portfolio. And crypto is very small, less than 3% of my total net worth on anything that I hold in crypto related. I have much more greater gold holdings and I just share those because people ask, you need to make better life decisions. But if we take a quick look at the Bitcoin price, we or the XRP price, we can see since the last time I talked, nothing significant has changed. The last time we talked, we were coming back off of this quick wick pump, but we're in this humongous bear flag. And this bear flag comes off, uh, of course, I would do that, the most recent top uh, from 2021 COVID-induced pump up here. And then we came crashing down. But really what this is, is right here is your flagpole. It's humongous 50%. And this is when Three Arrows Capital, this is when BlockFi, this is when Celsius, uh, and this is when uh, Sam Bankman freed, they all went down and everybody lost their money because they were paying interest by staking coins with money they couldn't come up with by uh, lies and the only way most of those or all of those companies were doing it by either a a combination of a which a would be they had a token that they would trade and or sell into the open market to pay interest and b this could be a combo by itself or with a b was um they were getting new uh investors that were staking to pay old interest payments which is a la a ponzi scheme but this is what happens when you have big corrections or crashes of greater than 50 percent that's your flagpole this is your flag right here this humongous elongated rising channel right there with your flag and then your technical target would be from the top of the flagpole to the bottom which would get you right down here i believe to about 24 cents if we do a quick targeted move uh but at first you can see you got into this uh falling rising channel here you be bottomed out here at about 28 cents back here in 2022 hit upper resistance in october of 2022 hit lower resistance a few times in november and then again in january of 2022 and 2023 then in march of 23 upper resistance the blow off top with the manipulations the orchestration of the news culminating with the technicals culminating uh with outside judge news had that humongous pump fake out to the upside quickly gave back the whole gang and went back down all the way to the bottom of the lower support back here in August, just a month, a uh, month and a half after we had this big blow off top where every channel was telling you this was going to be way up here now. And then it traded sideways to down. Then we had upper resistance again. We had our triple rejection of DOP at 91, 74, and 72. And then we had the big wick out in April of 2024. And then we've just traded up and sideways since then. And then this morning, we actually had a quick wick back down through here last night, this morning. And then we pulled back up or Friday. And now we're threatening to break back down out of here. And that is still where you're in and a technical target on it if we do break down and confirm a pattern breakdown of this you would go from the top of the handle to the bottom to the point of a breakout all the way over here and that would get you down here to about the 15 cent level all the way down here a target that we've been waiting for that we almost hit last year before we had our big pull up and that's how you would get down there and i know a lot of people aren't talking about that but this would be a 66.69 percent flash crash a uh, liquidation of all liquidations bringing crypto to its knees because nobody else is seeing this everybody else is seeing this that they say is going to happen but this is a really real distinct possibility and something that i'm paying attention for uh, and again, I am not a financial advisor. These are just things that I'm paying attention for and obviously looking to see if they happen as the XRP price is currently sitting down here again uh, after breaking back through here this morning on the most recent pump after getting rejected a few times last night, did break back into this uh, rising channel and you see it here trying to confirm into it. And if you can confirm into it, your very first upper resistance would be if we zoom out here more into like the hour chart would be up here at the uh last major upper resistance getting into this area the 53 
to 55 cents would be major upper resistance if you can get some buyers and sort of trade up and sideways like this, right? But if you get rejected down out of here, your first major area would be down here at the wick bottom at 45 cents. So this is a major area. You need to see if this is a big pattern change where we're going to confirm the breakdown out of here now or if we're gonna trade along here in sideways and sort of weasel our way up over the next 48 days, right? So that's the two things we're looking at. Harsh rejection south. This is the major area you're looking to stay above here right now. And you're actually on top of it beautifully right now in the XRP price. The Bitcoin's the same thing. You're sitting here uh, struggling uh, and meandering your way up uh, the rising channel here. And you've been threatening to break back into here for several weeks and you actually did back here in May, break back down to the midpoint, or if we zoom out here into the weekly pattern a little bit, that area that, oh, come on, get out of here. That area that we have here in purple was the median or the mid ground support and resistance area in our mountain double top of the re of the old all time high back from the COVID induced pump. And that's where we've been sitting here consolidating on in the weekly time frame. And then if we break this into the four hour time frame for several weeks now, we've been straddling ever since we had the relief rally off of here and had the great 15,000 point move essentially overnight. We've been just trading along it sideways along this upper major, uh, resistance now that it's turned into again of the rising channel because you're either going to continue and you're going to breach this bullish and go to an all-time high or you're going to fastly fall all the way back down to 58,248 and then eventually uh the slower support level at 53,700 uh, and sixty nine dollars up trending. So you're either coming down here really fast over the next four to eight weeks, or you're going to an all time high with a current price of sixty nine thousand nine hundred and sixty nine dollars and sixty nine cents. Like, subscribe, and share. Peace and love.